Hi, my name is Meera Kumar Raju, and I'm associate professor uh, with the Applied Psychology program at Southern Illinois University, Carbondale. And uh, this morning, I'm presenting uh, a poster that I've done as part of a larger study where we compared college students in a cross-national sample from India and the United States. And uh, the data that I'm presenting here is the work that I did with students in India. So we collected stu the data from stu uh, students from two university uh, and colleges in the city of Hyderabad. And we wanted to examine uh, how students process information, the learning strategies that they use in relation to their motivation. And uh, what we found in our study is that students who were more reflective in terms of how they learned the material, the material that they read in the textbooks or uh, they heard in lectures, if they used strategies that were more reflective, where they uh, process information more elaboratively, they connected to uh, what they learned to what they were experiencing in life, or they were able to connect it to other things that they were learning, uh, they were more likely to be intrinsically motivated. And uh, we, so we found that re reflective learning strategies predicted 6% of the variance in intrinsic motivation. And then on the flip side, we found that uh, students who did not process information more reflectively or who did not try to learn as much as they could uh, were more, like, more likely to be amotivated. So these learning strategies, all of them uh, pr predicted 10% of the variance in lack of motivation. And so uh, one of the implications that uh, we take away from these uh, results is that uh, instructors who are able to uh, get the students to process information more deeply are more likely to be able to get the students to be motivated. Uh, in terms of future directions, uh, I uh, will be looking at many other individual level and contextual variables that influence uh, students' motivation. So I'd be looking at um, contextual factors such as socioeconomic status, uh, how much the cultural uh, sort of background values education, and how that might influence uh, students' motivation. And my favorite part of the conference has been uh, the uh, pr presidential symposium on social cognition as well as the international flavor of this entire conference.